Okay, viewers, Assalamu alaikum. It is a very basic demo uh, for streaming the IP camera to my browser. So how can I do that? So just to show you, I bought this uh, Tapo TP-Link IP camera. It's something like 130, 35 ringgit. And after setup, I get this 146 IP here. So it's my router homepage, as you can see, TP-Link. Now, uh, when I want to access this one, so it actually but actually uh, sends RTSP protocol data. So it's like real time streaming protocol. And this is the IP, this is the port. If you can see here, if I double click this one, and yes. Okay, this one is working fine. But the problem is that since it is RTSP protocol, uh, we cannot directly render this into our web page because in our web page, video tag doesn't support RTSP, RTMP, and other protocols. To do that, we have to install Flash or some third party other proprietary plugins like uh, Silverlight, Flash, something like those. So, first task is to detect the stream and convert it to HLS. I guess you remember HLS means HTTP, live, I forget every time, uh, stream response probably, HLS protocol. So how can I do that? To do that, I need to have a FFM, FFMPEG command. And this one is the command. It's okay, you can see the password. It's, it's just fake localhost password, it's okay. But we can, if we press this one, uh, what will happen is, uh, let me just clear this one, my whole folder, control A. Okay, nice, so yeah, my videos folder is empty, okay. So what will happen is, if I run this command, it detects the stream, I guess you can see here, and it converts and saves the data into N3 E8 and in this folder. So I'm just running this, and if you, if you can see, yeah, it's rendering. So step two is done. That is, uh, we can successfully get the stream and convert it on the fly. Now our task is to send this converted HTTP supported stream to our browser. To do that, actually I create this very basic file read code and server. I actually copied this, to be honest. And But I know what it, ha it does, it's very easy code block. And now I need to run this server, server2.js. So what will happen is my code block is waiting for any request. And whatever we give here in the URL, it detects uh, reads the file and response the content. Now, this response can be read only through an a HLS supported f uh, player. Okay, so currently I'm actually using, uh, okay, I can come here later, but if you are in Mac, most probably you can s use the quick player. Why is it not working? Maybe I should close it, open again. Open. Gosh. Okay, I'm not sure why it's not working. Anyway, uh, we can go to our HLS dev Netlify. In here, we can set this URL and press apply. 
and see it is inside of the browser. So I'm just pointing my Node.js server M3 E8 file here, and this HLSJS is actually detects and rend captures the stream and rendering here. To show you a good demo, what I can do is uh, I have a mobile app already here for the Tapo, and I can just do my horizontal thing, horizontal cruise. So what happening is that my camera is sending data to FFmpeg, and that FFmpeg is converting that, and the converted file is hosted inside of a Node.js server, and that Node.js server is serving the converted file, m 3 e 8 and that m 3 e 8 file is being shown from HLS-supported player, which is this one. So it's just pretty much simple as that. So if I just, con I just move this uh, code block into any online server, and if you want to, ch if you want to have the URL, you can see any live stream from anywhere. So yeah, I decoupled my local camera camera type. Actually, I can use any type of camera and show it in any web support browser. And even if uh, if I want to show it inside of any uh, mobile browser, it's also supported because it's HLS. Uh, HLS. HTTP live streaming, yeah. I forget every time. So yeah, that's all I wanted to demo. Uh, so now my plan is to, what? Create a React app and host this HLS stream into that React application and host that React application uh, somewhere in the internet so that anyone can see the stream, which is actually coming from my local internet, uh, localhost camera. It's pretty, pretty much awesome, right? So yep, that's all. Thanks for watching.